I think about where the customer of the future is actually going and yeah. how we can build capabilities to serve that customer of the future. So that way we don't become irrelevant, right? So, you know, think about it from the perspective of, um, of, of you know, even if we look at workers' compensation or a, a multi-line carrier and specifically what we're doing in AF Group is we have a significant base of what I would call small business customers. Yeah. Um, and when you think about the way that things have changed for those small business customers, they, you know, especially, um, you know, over the last couple of years with the pandemic happening, a lot of those customers don't necessarily want to sit in an agent's office, for example. Some do, not 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 all do. Um, so that they don't want to sit in an agent's office to try to figure out whether or not they're going to be able to get their insurance, right? So a lot of yeah. them are actually being influenced by non-insurance organizations in this insurance space that, that we're working in. So there, there are things that they want to do, like, you know, have the ability to go online very quickly, um, you know, potentially get a quote. Now, it may be, um, you know, done in a, in a, in a non-manual way, right? In sort of a digital way. Yeah. Um, but the way that I see this playing out is, you know, it may start in a digital environment. They may then have a question where they want to pick up the phone or send an email or something, but they then want to end that transaction in, in, a, in a digital environment. So digital uh, analog back to digital is the way, the way that it happens, right? I'm Abel Travis from AF Group, and this is the future of insurance.